Usually it's crispy and juicy. Well, not juicy, it's just crispy. It's like paper thin. Right now it's soggy. It's literally like a roti, which is it's not the one, but I like mine stuffed with actually this potato called masala dosa. And I like to eat this with something. It's like a soupy, saucy stuff. It's called sambar. sambar. Shall we start? Yeah, go. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you know, Lady and I first met and we did, we did an Iranian mukbang, which was super bland. Um, she wanted to do another one. I was like, absolutely not. We've had Iranian three times this week. We're doing South Indian. Yeah. South Indian is one of my favorite cuisines. Mm -hmm. I know you eat this. Like, if that's a, that's the Batura. Yeah, I know. I'm you gonna start doing that. No, I will. I will. I just had it for the show. <laughs> <laughs> this is it's literally called paper rose. It looks like a used handkerchief. <laughs> but we had like a long drive, a lot of traffic. Yeah. Sorry, we should have called them five minutes before. You're right. They kept it ready for so long. Did they? Yeah. You can see it's cold. <laughs> It's like, yeah, it's cold, it's not crunchy. But Indian food hits regardless. And true. we did a rainy before, so we decided to do Indian this time. And I don't know, it's like two days before my flight. Okay, let's get let's started. Okay, so we have some questions that a lot of you guys sent me. So we're just gonna answer that and eat as we go along. So get some snacks. The first question, any shows you're currently watching? Well, since Euphoria stopped, no. Mm -hmm. Oh no, actually, Love is Blind mm -hmm. and then um, 90 Day Fiance, but before the 90 days. 90 Day Fiance is so boring, but before the 90 days is actually juicy. Wait, can we talk about Love is Blind, the Indian couple? <laughs> You can comment, you're fine. Elise, Elise is here too. Hi guys. She's in the background. Yeah. She's, she's behaving like my boyfriend right now. So <laughs> yeah, actually, Shut you, your mouth. You're literally <laughs> like a lot of boyfriends. They're like put in behind the camera. So that's I'm like, do thing. not breathe. Be quiet. Elise is that like, yeah. I'm like, you're a girl, you're yeah, good. Yeah, you're fine. I just came in and Elise Wait. and Lily were like, you have to watch this Indian couple. Love no, you have to. Oh, so you watch, but you didn't watch how they met. Like, nothing, they nothing. Met. I was a dick from the beginning. And then I, on oh, my TikTok. you need to go watch. You need to watch the beginning. Like, we'll rewatch it. No, I'm on that TikTok now and I was blind because you guys made me watch it once. And like, that's she what I see. You, so yeah. I was like, no, no, you have to watch Just this. for the Indian couple. Because mm -hmm. you need to see what the guy is like. What's your name? My name is Deepti. So you're Indian? Yes. Oh shit, how'd you know? She's within a two mile radius from me. That booty is not safe. He's actually this like really sweet, articulate, sensitive, and fun, outgoing person. Apparently he hit her up after the show and she declined. No way. Yeah, and she talked about how like, she did an interview, a Zoom interview, and she's like, he doesn't, he has no self-awareness. And like, he doesn't know how to read the room. And he thinks that he's like a TV character. I just feel like he's never been with a woman before. Yeah, he, I feel like he's a virgin. He's never seen touched a clit. But also like, <laughs> there's he's never found a clit. Even if you touch a vagina, he's never. Still Searching, <laughs> looking around through the Indian railway stations and rivers. He is embarrassing because I saw like a, a DM he shared with a boy. Yeah. Oh, and he's like, I never wanted the brown card. <gasps> like, you can keep it. Stop it. Like, I'm missing out a lot of context, but yeah. I sent you the TikTok, so you should check it out. I'll oh, post it you. here, but. No, but I want to film you reacting to when they meet in the room. Like, the first, you know, when they meet. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You told me they grabbed our butts and they like, made out. No, that was after. Like, the initial meeting was just embarrassing. No, he grabbed her Yeah, he did, but like, before for that, like when they were like discussing in the room. <laughs> my test for if I can date a girl or not, which is if I can put her on my shoulders at a music festival, then she's within a physical range that, that I would date. Oh yeah, he was like, don't tell her. No, no, <laughs> she's never gonna watch it. She he was like, <laughs> she's never gonna watch it. I'm not that type, like I yeah. He was like, cause basically no. there's a wall and you, so can't, you can't see, see the see. other person. Yeah, I know what that like, yeah. the part of the show. Mm -hmm. So then basically the guy was like, trying to figure out if she was fat or not and how heavy she was and he was like, so, like, if you go to a festival, would I be able to put you on my shoulders? Like, are you, what kind of weight are you? I've seen bits then, of that. And yeah. he goes, oh, I like to buy women clothes. Like, what's your size? Oh, to find out secretly yeah. how fat she is. Yeah, imagine. I don't know, a lot of, uh... It's like, just go on the wrong show, sweetheart. Okay, where did he grow up? Did you know, do you know that? Like, where did he, what was Apparently he raised? Apparently he grew up in the, in the States. He reminds me of that boy that I made a reaction video on. Have you seen it? Oh, yeah, of yeah, Of yeah. on TikTok. It's, he literally goes like, I hate brown women. I love Love, blue eyes, blonde hair, give me all of that. Like, I mean, mm -hmm. they're just, ugh, you can't do anything. I don't know what they're 
what they eat every day. Honestly, that was like, he was so bad. But then also another interesting relationship I found was Shane, mm. Shayna and Natalie. First of all, I thought Shane and Shayna were like the perfect pair. Like you two are both as weird as each other. You should be together. He went for like poor old Natalie who was like so simple. He's seemingly very sweet and like someone who's got his shit together. And he was just completely like off his face the whole show, like wired. It's just hard for me to believe that this is all not paid. This is all fake. No, no, I think some of it was staged. It is Actually, staged. wait, no. It is staged, right? There are outfits that are staged for sure. No, I read that the producers told Deep Tea to say no first. I saw that too. But that's, see, that's messed up. Why, if you're gonna get a girl on the show and let's say it was me and I want to say yes because I'm a dumbass. I wouldn't have seen the red flags and be like, I want to go out with this guy. I would have said yes, but the producers they want tea, they want drama, and we all expected him to dump her because whatever whatever his reasons yeah, were. Yeah, it was so much better that she dumped him because then you got to see his tacky but that's reaction. That's not authentic though. Like, wouldn't it be more fun if she said yes and then he said no? No, and then that she... would have been so sad. But the fact that he went after and was like, yeah, I was gonna say no anyways. Like, oh, I got reservations at Nobu. Yeah, no oh boo. Oh my god, with that is so... Nobu with no boo, literally. <laughs> I was like, what? No, that's so embarrassing to be like, I dumped him, I'm going to Burger King now. Like, <laughs> no one's in a big deal. I only got reservations. Okay, cool. No, I told you, Americans think the stupidest restaurants are a big deal. He thought Nobu was a big deal. That's such a, that's like next to like our, between our alleys. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. They like hype up um, freaking, I don't know. It's like, catch is a big deal in LA. I mean, I've had better restaurants. Like, I'll be honest, food in America just doesn't, mm. just doesn't hit the spot. There's a lot of like trashy stuff in there. And if it's, ex if it's good food, it's so mad expensive. Wait, I need to ask, how does everyone like to eat their dose or their idiot? <laughs> you dump it in there. I dunk oh it in there. Oh my God. I love it dunked. I like it soaked. Mm. I usually put lots of ghee on it when it's like piping hot. I put the chili powder. Mm. I don't like the chutney. Uh, the white chutney? Oh, with, you mean, this one or just in oh, oh, okay. Listen, the yellow chutney is so good. I don't know what it is. It's coconut, right? They're all coconut. Chutneys are made of all coconut. Mm -hmm. What else? <laughs> this is a fun question for you. How do you, How overcome, do you overcome body, body issues? issues? With that clinic and money is the question. Elise answer answer. Wait, what? Sorry, what? How do you overcome body issues? Honestly, starve yourself starting? to death. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Don't kidding. Eat. I'm just kidding. We're not. Um, I am. I honestly just eat whatever I want, but I'll hit the gym hard. I feel like Either you eat really strict, like you starve yourself to death and all that shit, but like, then you don't have to be strict with gym. But I work out almost every day and I love working out. Like it's my favorite thing to do ever. Whatever releases estrogen, serotonin, melatonin after you hit the gym is what I love. Like you get high off of that. And there are like artificial ways to do that, but I love going to the gym, feeling so good. And then I eat whatever I want. I prefer the other kinds of highs to be honest. Yeah, she does. I do not, I just like to wear I don't mine. get the gym high. It's not, it just doesn't, it doesn't happen to me. You want to try No, I'm like Loki Don. Bitch, you're so embarrassing. <laughs> We're five minutes into the video. You know that, right? Wait, one sec. Did you get involved in the event in Prague? Yes. The fashion show? Yes. And they want six posts. Yeah, here, here it comes. But they're not paying for Here it anything. comes. Here it comes. Six feed posts. Mm -hmm. True event. No, okay. so she messaged me. She's like, I'll give you a thousand dollars credit on this site yeah, but that's bullshit. for what two outfits. Oh, I was like, as many outfits as you want and two Instagram posts at the event. I'm like, who's gonna post no, two things? I'm not going. Everyone everything. in America runs away from them. It's just ridiculous. Saying. They're not paying. Yeah, they're not paying. So what did you tell them? Exactly. Then? Like, what am I gonna get for it? Nothing. Okay. What free clothes? Yeah, exactly. Why am she? Like, Anyways, if you're gonna yeah. give me like decent brands, fine. You cut up the name of the brand. Antique <laughs> <laughs> was supposed to be at an event tonight in LA. Everyone knows what we're talking about. By the way, you've said it. Like, I'll cut them some parts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, every Caller Daddy talked about it. I don't know if you know the podcast. A brand that just does not pay. They about only hire white brand. models, and yeah. they'll like they want you to post eighteen, 18 times. times. And then yeah. they're paying. They made my friend do the same thing. No way. She had to post like eight times. It's not Fashion Nova. Fashion Nova pay, and no. they have budget. Yeah. We love Fashion Nova. I <laughs> should Fashion Nova please sponsor us again. Thank yeah. You. We were like on a juicy fucking contract. That was a juicy. They paid. Contract. I'm pretty sure for full of my Tesla. I have electricity. It's because of Fashion Nova, so shout out to them. <laughs> no. I like their clothes, so it wasn't like a fake thing, you know what I mean? No, but I actually like the pieces that I got. Like when and they I were like, you nicely. No, when they were like, it's a shitty brand, like why are you talking about? I'm like, but this is what I actually wear, and I, <laughs> I, 
I enjoy writing it. So I'm like, what do you mean? I'm I'm like shitting on the. Br I'm done. Yeah, I think you went through pages. I'm pretty sure, like eight, ten, twenty. Did you like? Like, did you just straight up see something and pick it up? No, no right. I yeah. spent hours. She scoured the internet for sure. Yeah. But I actually like the pieces you picked out. Well, you're I like still really, shop there, by the way. Like, I really some, dig. I really like their basics, like the Kiki crop top, the Robin tops. I love those. I still buy those. Can Everyone's I like, where say? are your basics from? I'm like, uh, Fashion Nova, babe. Yeah. I don't see a difference between Fashion Nova and somewhere like Pretty Little Thing. It's no. I think they're the same. Are, are they just Fashion Nova is a bit more Americanized in terms of style. But then people, I feel like people put Fashion Nova in a different category and I don't no, know why. It's still all fast fashion. People make fun of Fashion Nova mainly for the BBL outfits because yeah. everybody in LA, you can yeah. see the bodycon dresses, you're like, it's Fashion, fashion Nova. Nova. It's the BBL fashion. Everybody in LA is like the same copy. They didn't lie. Mm. That's that. Do you want to have Chana? Do you want to try it? One bite. I can't, I'm so full. Okay, sweets. Yeah, I'll have a little Okay, bite. thank God. Can you get two spoons? Yeah. Shouldn't even touch their food, you guys, but we're just bashing on two brands. Um, we have the next question. What's your advice on breaking up? Can everyone just, I want to know everyone's like perspective. I think you have to ghost. You did not stop. You did not look at their profiles. Just, I just numbed the pain. That's how I, green chutney. Sorry, who have you broken up with? <laughs> I mean, I'm talking about five years ago. Oh, I should get, you have had relationships, like keep forgetting. Yeah, that's so hard, my friends. Like, I'm known as that friend. I'm gonna be the last one to get married. You know what I mean? Or like, no, barely. you never know. Dude, you never know. I'm telling you. You honestly know. never I am that friend. Auntie could be the one that gets married in Vegas and she's like, ah, oh, by the yeah. way, I'm Okay, that will be yeah, me. Yeah, like, yeah. I'm, I'm a crazy. Uh, case three, bro. Yeah. But what? I've, wait, what, what is, what is, Halva. Yeah. No, that's not Halva. Is it not? It's not oh, oily. No, no, that's, you're thinking of different. This is. I know what Halva is, bro. No, this is carrot. Oh, yeah. This is carrot, right? Mm -hmm. Carrot Halva. What is, is it? Is it? I don't know what Kastri is made of. It's yummy. Tell yeah. me if you like it. Bro, no. This is literally. <laughs> I have to take this for my dad. He's gonna ask for this. This is. We, my dad and I, we fight no, with no. this all the time. It's so good. This is like a smash Ladu. And she hates Ladu. Ladu. No, this like is more Ladu? soft and creamy. No. But yeah, yeah, I get what you mean. Yeah. This is so delicious. But I was just saying. Mmm. Yeah, how do you um, recover from a breakup? You go, block, her. delete, ignore. But you still stalk. Let me just see who's following. Sometimes I like, stalk. That's what I said, we girls don't stalk. Guys don't, you know that? Somebody on TikTok once said that if a guy watches a story, you're like, oh my God, he watched my story. Yes, he's but like keeping an account. <laughs> don't give a fuck. Yeah. They just be like, this is how they literally go like, next, Oh no, next, actually, I've been with some talks to people who are like, I didn't see that you saw, you didn't see my story. Wait, what? Wait, Wait what? what? No, I, I know some guys who actually are like toxic, like women. What do you mean? Like, they'll watch your story. They'll purposely look to see if you watch their story. Like, for instance- Okay, that's a girl then. You didn't need a boy. Yeah, you're both playing each other. I know, you're- You're, you're playing yourself. yourself. But you know when it has some, You know how it is in the beginning of a relationship, like, you post, like, certain stories because you want a reaction from a guy. Okay, that's true. Don't tell me you've not done it. Like, you, you'll post, like, certain things. Like, you'll you'll go out of your way, like, to play tennis. Like, look, bitch, I'm sporty. I'm, I'm out here making no, moves. What, I'm oh, what I do would be so embarrassing. I would do things like- There was this guy- <laughs> that who liked emo girls. <laughs> <laughs> Auntie. Auntie goes, <laughs> she comes over her head. I have a picture. I'm gonna show you. And then you know, remember when everyone used to go spinnies and get like the apple. You remember the apple, the thing that used to cover the apple that no. you went with glass. What? Oh my god, those like those like <laughs> the net. <laughs> The no, net. I did fishnet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wore black smoky, and I'm like, and then you, yeah, I'm like trying to, you know, tell myself, I'm like. Yeah, you look hot. <laughs> yes, you do look hot. You're fine. In my head, I'm like, I look horrible. Oh but God. I did that only to please him. He's like, oh, love rock bands and rock oh bands. You're like, yeah, That's too. all I did. I, I listened to, to it. I would like study the lyrics. No, I, did, <laughs> I did the whole nine just to please him. How old were you? Jinx. Jinx. I want to say uh, 19, okay. 20. Oh, that's a bit old. That's no, bit old for you, y'all. I was 23, I was 24 just this month, like whatever. So, I was doing this when I was what? Elise, I was doing this when I was 15. Nine. No, no, no. 19, 19 is a bit scary and embarrassing. I was an adult yeah, in college. 19 is old. Yeah, 19, yeah, 19, yeah, 19, old 19 is pretty old. So, <laughs> but I did everything that whatever he told me, he would say, you know, I love this place. I'm like, no, I, no, no, no. <laughs> no, I'll eat it and he'll be like, I'll, I'll eat it and he, you like, it sucks. I'm like, mm, yeah. yeah. Oh, it sucks. I'm like, I was like, like I'm a simp like that. <laughs> I want to know, where is this guy now? God knows. Oh, I want to, um, he has a divorce, like, situation. <gasps> like, no, not him. Oh. His parents. <laughs> 
Alexis. So he was in like a very bad stage. Like I shouldn't have been dating this guy. Right. But I did, yeah. You, oh, you date actually ended up dating him? Yeah, I was in a full blown relationship. Oh, but shit. I'm saying starting up, up front, like I would just do whatever he told me to. And yeah. that's like, oh, that's embarrassing. So if you want to ever get over somebody, I think it's just that you have to cut all ties. I'm talking yeah. sister, mom, brother. You cannot be friends with my, but I'm friends with his sister. No, you're yeah, done. Yeah. I'm very black and white like that. And people think I'm cold, but like mentally you're not going to move on. I personally have always had a relationship with the family of whoever I'm dating, which is why it's always harder for me to separate that. Uh, you're not special. We're all the same. <laughs> you think I'm friends with the dentist of my boyfriend? I'm friends with the mom and dad. Yeah, but what I'm saying is it is hard. It yeah. is hard to do, but like you have to do it. Do you want to pour the gulab jamun gulab? You can have it, babe. I really don't want it. Okay, one that. bite for no, the cam. Are you that full? I hate it. Okay, okay, guys, we are. We're done almost. Okay, guys, one last bite, sees. <laughs> This is literally sugar syrup. The fun part is I went to a dentist just like five hours ago. And they were before. like, don't have right. any more sweets. Oh, like I have a cavity filling today. <laughs> and they were like, no sweets. I'm like, okay. And I have a cool job and okay. Oh Let's see God. how this is. It's good. They've amped up the freaking cardamom as per usual. Oh. They always do that. I don't know why. I don't mind cardamom. Oh. No one is like too much. Yeah, you can tell Not the spice. in my butter chicken. Yeah, that is true. We went to a restaurant, you guys. Wow. It was an Indian <laughs> restaurant. Cardamom everywhere. <laughs> We smell like carbon at the end of the day. Okay, okay. make sure you guys check hey, out my no. new um, podcast. Hey, no. Thank you so much for. <laughs> you couldn't wait, bitch. I actually need. I need like followers now. Thank you guys so much for watching. She has a new. You, you should have a podcast by now. It's literally. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually setting up right podcast. now. It's the podcast box is underneath the camera tripod as we are talking. So, yeah. where do you upload this to? Or you film yourself talking? Yeah, if not like. It's an audio like software. Film. No filming. Just I recording audio. Okay, yeah. So, first of all, subscribe to my podcast. I'm talking a lot of shit. Spilling a lot of tea. Karak chai. Maybe spilling... she'll post once a month. Yeah, spilling karak chai, but only once a month, unfortunately. We're a little slow, <laughs> less employees. But She's busy. Busy and booked. But Ancy and Rancy podcast here. And then we have Lying <laughs> with Laylee. <laughs> yeah, we think you're calling it that. We don't know. We, we actually call it lying, but like lying in bed with Laylee. Or like That's lying. so fucking That's smart. Really good. Like, oh my god, you gotta get that copyrighted. And then people be like lying and lying. Like in bed with Laylee. No, lying, lying with, with Laylee. Laylee. So they might be like, you're, you're lying, lying, but you're but actually, actually lying. lying. That is yeah. so funny. And then every smart. time I get a guest, we'll have to be in bed together. Yeah. But make sure ass. your art is also like you're in bed, like. <laughs> oh, cool. Do you want to be my podcast? <laughs> you we have to be in bed together. But lying that's, with that's actually so like smart. Lying. I yeah. know you're not going to fucking use it because there's lying in it, but it's yeah, so funny. No, like Honestly, I wish I it's had funny, it as like angry antsy or like lying with antsy. No, the antsy antsy is like the best. It's so yeah, good. It's yeah. actually the best. It's actually so good. I think it's cringy now. No, when they saw it, I was like, oh my god, it's so good. Maylee? Paley. Bailey. 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 No, I like lying with Laylee for that. You need something with an L. Loving with Laylee? No. No. Lying. Um, that's what I do best. So she's lying and I'm just ranting. You mind? <laughs> so sub to that. What else do you have going on? Petite the bread. Oh, I have petite the bread on. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm sponsored by petite. Little stained from the food, but <laughs> it is cute. So check out petite the bread. Fat the bread. <laughs> check out fat the bread. <laughs> Linked below. Sub to her YouTube channel. What else do you have going no, on? No, we don't need your audience. <laughs> I don't know why your she hates Your audience is not my audience. She does not want my audience. <laughs> Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Love you guys so much. I'll see you guys in my next video. <laughs> Pack your bags, Elise Global, right no, now. No, wait, can we set up my laptop class? Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Please. Oh, check me. Yum, yum. Chole bature. Chole ke piche. What is that song? Chole ke piche. Oh, yum. Oh, my mouth is watering. Oh my god, they're both coconut chocolate. So are you gonna eat all of it? Yeah, it's a mukbang. <laughs> <laughs>